hello guys today in this video i'm going to tell you how you can fix this issue if your hsbc app is not working then how you can fix this issue my dear friends there may be several reasons due to your app is not working so we can't find which error is coming so we need to fix one by one each error so these are the main causes of the you can say app is not working problems so first is maybe your internet speed maybe new version of app or you can say catch overload or corruption corrupted app and apps is not connected with your mobile then how you can fix this issue so first of all we are going to fix the internet speed so first of all before checking each and everything you need to check out your internet okay so because of internet due to internet connectivity your app may be not working properly so you need to check your app internet connection so if your internet speed is good hope this will fix your issue if not uh, if your internet is good and still your app is not working then you need to change or you can say you need to update your app okay so in this method you need to check out your uh, up latest update of the apps so in this method you need to open your app store or you can say you need to visit on your uh, app store and you need to find your application name like uh, over here you need to type your app name like this and once you type your in, in app name and you need to find your name so this is just only an example you just need to find out your app and over here you can see in the front of your app like update option if the update is available then you can update this uh, button and once you update you can uh, open your app again okay hopefully this will fix your issue if not if still you are facing same issue then what you have to do you need to follow the second app then you need to follow in this method you need to offload your app so in this method what you have to do you need to open your application or you can say ios settings and once you are on ios settings what you have to do you need to find like journal and once you click on journal you need to navigate iphone storage and on iphone storage you need to find out your app so this is an only an example so you just need to find your hsbc app and once you find your app just simply click on app and uh, click on offload app and once you click on offload app you just need to simply click on offload app and once you click on offload app you need to it will take some time depends on your internet or you can say depends on your how much file of your cache it will take approx three to five seconds and once it will done it will pop up a new window like reinstall app so you need to just reinstall your app now you will restart your app hopefully this will fix your issue if still you are facing same issue then in this case you need to reinstall your app or you can say you need to completely remove your app or you need to reinstall your app again okay so in this method you need to simply visit on the same screen like as you before gone and uh, once you are on this page offload app page you need to simply click on delete app once you click on delete app your app will be deleted and now you need to visit on your app, app store again and find your app and get it and once again and once you get your app just simply open your app hopefully this will fix your issue right now okay so if you're still facing same issue then what you have to do you need to check out your internet uh, or you can say mobile date and connectivity with your app so in this method you need to check out your uh, uh, mobile application date and time okay so you need to check out your uh, internet uh, or you can say you need to check out your uh, date and time so make sure your time is correctly uh, updated as uh, to the network connection okay so, so make sure turn this uh, bot toggles on and once you've done this so and restart your mobile and once you've done these both steps you you will see your application error will fix so these are the fixes by using these methods you can easily fix your hsbc app not working problem if you have any questions you can make a comment i will reply you very soon and thanks for watching this video Bye bye